two of my massive Fashion Nova jean try-on. There will probably be a part three and a part four. Uh, but today I have five pairs of jeans from Fashion Nova that I'm going to try on for you, tell you how I feel about them, and just basically struggle to get these tight ass jeans on. <laughs> uh, my legs are kind of worn to the bone, it feels, because taking skinny jeans off, putting them on, taking them off, putting them on, uh, it is, it's painful for your thighs. So uh, <laughs> I won't need to exfoliate for, I don't know, about two weeks. So Fashion Nova does not know I'm doing this, so this is not sponsored. I ordered a ton of jeans just on my own. It was a buy one, get one free, a BOGO, and Fashion Nova does this quite often where they put their entire site, like crazy sale, on sale. Puts their stuff for sale for cheap. <laughs> well, I have five pairs of jeans for you guys that uh, uh, one I couldn't get on but I still show you <laughs> uh, how it's sort of three quarters of the way there, but just impossible. Stretchy jeans are the only way to go, especially if you're a leggings wearer like me and you um, are all about comfort. So let's just get straight into the haul. I'm going to be letting you guys know the jean style or the name of each the name of each pair of jeans and the try on part so there's no confusion about which pair I'm wearing and also the color. All right, let's start off with a bang. <laughs> These jeans are the ones that I could not get on. And uh, I get that there can't be stretch in these jeans because there's like literally no stretch in these jeans at all. Uh, I get it because that is how they get this distressed look. If it was a stretchy pair of jeans, it wouldn't look the same. Like it wouldn't have this distressed kind of hangy look to it, so I get it. Uh, however, I couldn't get them on and they flattened out my butt really weird. I couldn't do up the button, uh, it was a disaster. These are called Cut the Check Boyfriend Jeans in Medium Blue Wash, size seven. Forgot to mention that all of these jeans that I'm wearing are in a size seven. Okay, so it's a shame. I like the look of them. But couldn't get them on. They're a bit distressed. They're a bit distressed. <laughs> they're a bit distressed. Uh, and they're actually not skinny jeans. They have this little flare at the bottom with this little side cut, uh, which I think is gonna look really cute with a pair of high heels. Uh, and they fit actually quite well. They're not as tight in the waist as I would prefer, but I can always fix that with a cute little belt. Um, I like these. These are called Killing Em Kindly High Rise Jeans in Medium Blue Wash, size seven. got it from my mama jeans in medium wash. The, yeah, medium wash. So these are mom jeans. And you know what? I kind of like them. I don't know. 
normally when I see mom jeans modeled by a model, <laughs> they usually pair them with kind of a baggier sweater, like a cropped sweater, or they tuck it in the front. Um, and I could see myself pulling something like that off, like on a comfy day. But uh, I don't know. They are very comfortable. They have this little like roll cuff at the bottom. And okay, I'm just gonna put this out there. I feel like mom jeans look really good on if you're a size two because clearly you're skinny, but you're wearing jeans that are like a bit bigger, not necessarily skin tight, and you're just more relaxed looking or whatever. But I feel like if you have a size seven butt or like a 28 or a 29, I'm kind of in between sometimes, uh, it's not as flattering. So I get the fashion perspective, like on a size two model, but I'm just not super in love with the style, but maybe it's just me. I just have to like wrap my mind around a different fitting jean. my favorite I love it them <laughs> slightly distressed nothing too crazy I mean there are full-on holes in these so I guess they're pretty distressed these are called the Naya skinny jeans in light blue wash size 7 and uh, the butt you guys the butt works on my body <laughs> uh, they this is how I like my jeans to fit uh, and I know that after I wash them once, wash and dry them, they'll be perfect. They're a little bit, um, I don't want to say they're a little bit big. They're just not as tight as I'd like them to be. Cause you know, jeans stretch out throughout the day. So you want them a little tighter than what you would normally be comfortable in because like leather shoes, you will break them in. So love them. Highly recommend. This is definitely a winter jean for me and maybe for you too. these cello jeans so as I mentioned in part one Fashion Nova sells this brand of jean as well um, okay and these don't fit half bad if you like the style so these are like an acid wash notice the pockets are quite high on the butt this is gonna make your butt look a little longer um, but to be honest I don't hate the way this looks I think that they're really nice little cuff bottom there, a little rolled bottom, whatever you want to call it. Very, very high quality. I find the cello jeans are thicker and just a little bit more structured, which is what I like. Um, kind of like a traditional Levi's jean. Uh, and so here's the little tag it came with. And it says that it is a high rise crop. And I believe just in like the lightest wash that they make, unless they make a white or something, but I don't mind it.
Okay guys, let me know your thoughts on these jeans. These are all high-waisted jeans, sort of lighter wash jeans, and uh, you know, like very much on trend for what's popular these days. And what do you guys think about these high-rise jeans? Do you guys prefer low-rise jeans, mid-rise? Uh, let me know in the comments down below. Of course, if you are not part of my Wondercat family, one of my patrons, then please head on over there and check out all of the extra content that I put. I put much more content there than I do on YouTube these days. Um, I talk to my patrons directly and uh, yeah, we have a ton of fun and you do not want to miss out. Also, follow me on Instagram. I'm at cat.wonders. Don't miss out there either. And like this video if you enjoyed it. Make sure you subscribe. Stick around for part three. Uh, and yeah. If you guys have suggestions for hauls for me to do, then please leave that in the comment down below as well. The comments down below as well. And, uh, or email me too. Anyway, you guys, I hope you have an amazing weekend and I will see you all in my next video. Mm -hmm.